try and uh, take them out. Pain a little bit split because they've been outside of the circle for so long. All these compounds in the center of the map are going to be so crucial. Brawlers have a really large one and easy to control. Soul, they're popping shots over at ZFX. Yeah, How is that happening? ZFX are quite far away in the, the triple building compound as we hear some team comms. And it looks like Soul pushed onto it. They trying to breach away. onto the compound that ZFX have been in. Waste. Can he get the kill onto King? No, doesn't look like he's going to be That's able to. And Soul are going to go down in 14th, attempting a breach unsuccessfully onto ZFX Evolution. Not going to be able to get it done, unfortunately. A little bit overzealous. They moved into the zone. Pixel Spades, they're looking to rotate up ISO as well, moving away from them. ISO, one of the top-performing teams. We need to be aware of how strong they have been because their presence in these games has been felt. Coming soon, looks like they might be going for it this time around. This is the comms. Very, very fierce comms here as they discuss how they're going to breach on in. Hydra getting punished as well by Ninja. Getting the spray down. Are they are preparing. I think coming soon, uh, the, the ones we're hearing here, and they're basically saying we need to go up and get rid of Mega Stars. I don't speak Hindi, but the fierceness of their voice says that they need to clear out Mega Stars before they make the rotation here. This is really smart, dude. Who, who got the knock there? That was Mega Stars. Okay, they've got a little bit of an angle, but they get a knock in response as well. They're looking to go down. One has fallen so far for either squad. But at the moment, I believe the player who's gone down has just been able to isolate themselves. They are away. I don't know why coming soon and committing to this. They've lost too many members in this fight. They just need to piece out. Very difficult rotation to get into the new circle here for coming soon. They are going to try and clear out Mega Stars, who just have such a good crossfire set up. Here's the push. Not successful. Not coordinate with the team. And final boss will finish that one off. Coming soon, lose one member so far in this fight. And potentially going to lose the entire squad if they want to commit to this. They are going back down the staircase. They know they can't take Mega Stars out of the apartment blocks. So instead, they're going to go down, heal themselves, and just wait for Mega Stars to come to them. They didn't use any utility. They didn't throw in a nade. They didn't throw in a flashbang. They didn't try and distract it in any way, shape, or form. But Pixel Spades getting eliminated as well in the picture in picture. They are going to be able to be rolled on out ISO taking that one down you can see in the top left as well brawlers looking for another consistent performance they're looking to try and more, put more points on the board is Hydra only down to Bishma here pins it between ISO and learn from past looks like learn from past losing out on potato hills worked out for them here they've got the yellow houses to the north of Pachinki Hills. I can't believe coming soon might still want to be going for this. Am I? Looks like only Gatug left here for Orb. No, they actually have quite a few members up. Trying to breach by himself onto Demon King. The Uzi though, close range. Demon King in a good position. Gatug, can he get it? Double push comes through. Looking for it, but it's going to be ZFX holding on down in that single building there as Orb get eliminated in 11th place. And once more, ZFX Evolution hold on to their compound. Three teams grouped up here. Cold Blood is solo. Well, Maximus Alpha and Evil Big Fellas pop shots, but looks like ISO finally now the smoke is dispersed. Have got overview on Evil Big Fellas and are popping shots across the way. The circle has once more pushed on up. ZFX Evolution going to have to lose their uh, compound. And now the Brawlers have a really good spot in the zone because they're on that north westernly flank. They have the terrain that they can peek down from. Super. Potentially the Brawlers are going to have a, another standout performance here on Arangle. Because of the lack of cover, everybody and all of these teams have grouped around a single location. Yep. Nades are going to have so much value in this next push. I watch so out for the smokes and watch out for that utility being thrown on in. You can see here it comes from Omega looking to try and bounce something in. Oh, oh! huge nade. Double knock coming on out. And that is the value I was talking about. Those throwables going to be huge. The headshot comes in from ZFX and now it's Maximus Alpha to try and make this push. Satan going to be trying to deal death, but it's going to be not down and out, actually, by a lot of these players. Everybody's starting to fire on in. What was that from Satan? He just killed himself. ZFX Evolution. Sorry, Maximus Alpha. Basically get wiped. Disastrous push from them. I can't actually understand what happened. ZFX Evolution now fighting towards ISO, throwing nades across. You can see the Encore here from Learn From Pass trying to snoke it. Snake it on into the circle. The brawlers are just up to their left here. Really strong position for them, but they're going to get contested by Skull in just a second. Cross as well. But he's tucked in behind the smoke. He's got a little bit of cover. Some shots being fired off. Look at all of the brawlers looking behind them towards where ZFX Evolution is and where Hydra Bishmer is as well. We're in phase seven, about to hit phase eight. Going to get really tiny here, John. And finally, the brawlers frost peaking. Finds Demon King. The nade finishes off Bishma. Demon King will try and draw down the kill. And Find ZFX Evolution to get a res. The Brawler's sneaking closer, but again, paying cold blood. 
being allowed to cross the road safely. He's going to get to the care package for a bit of cover and a refresh on his armor as well. He has a very damaged tier 1 armor. If he can get that level 3, it could help him massively here. Doubt he's going to take the Mark 14. That's irrelevant at this stage. It looks like it's... Uh, between ZFX Evolution and the Brawlers, but depending on how Coldblood plays this, he could be the thorn in their sides. And we know already that Pain Coldblood is one of the most pinpoint accurate naders in the game. We've yeah. seen it time and time again from him that he can just wipe squads with a single nade. Brawlers, though. Why are they like they're, in vehicles? they're mounting up. Okay, let's see what they're able to get done. Coldblood does go down, so he's not going to be in this fight anymore. It's just one versus one in terms of the teams. These squads are going at it. Frost first to fall, so now it's three versus three. Nice and Molotov. There's a Molotov coming in. That's going to zone away the Brawler's Two. position as well. They're getting Made. knocked on down. They're getting burnt away as well. A lot of damage getting poured on through, but ZFX, they're really going to struggle to try and climb this hill. Two knocks here from the Brawlers. Frost nice down. Nade. That's another knock coming through. It's only Nova King to hold it for the brawler set effects know it and they're pushing through the smoke to take out nova king to take Aaron girl in match 11 here in the PUBG mobile club open a wrangle goes their way zfx again into the final circles into the final pass. pass yep who will uh, be overlooking that as well boom big shots coming through from the m249 uh, m24 sorry i should say Jelta is the, the center of the circle, the top end of the circle. You can see Mega Stars are going to claim it for themselves. The evil big fella is getting pushed upon by all from down the hill. The U.S. not providing enough cover for Spike, Sharko, Jemti, and Cave Sharko from the top of the hill. Gonna overlook and see if they can't do much to stop Orb with this push. You can see Lem from Pass crossing on into the circle. The Brawler is going to be at one side of Shelter. Mega Star is going to be at the other. And Pain Esports is going to be just north to them at this current point. Orb have pressure over towards evil big fellas at the moment. There's a nade coming through towards Spike. Should just be able to hide for now. But so there it goes. Oh, they're actually fall down. They're taking the fight to Mega Stars. And this time it's Dark and Frost is going to get fired upon. Nova King and Iconic trying to push from the other side. Trying to pinch it onto Mega Stars. But they're not successful just yet. Final Boss flushing on out. As the fight continues, Iconic goes down. That just leaves Frost by the. Darcia to try and take it all here and uh, I just can't see how he does it. The Brawler's looking to go out in 16th position. Does find a spray onto Leo. Nice stuff. Khan pushing with Shadow but he gets the knock. Can he get Khan as well? He's sprayed Oh down. my goodness How me. does he do that? Frost Brawlers. clutches it out and the Brawler survive taking Mega Stars down. Frost bites with Arctic Fury able to take them out and they are going to go out in 16th place. I thought it was all but done but they put them on ice. And they get it done. Incredible scenes from the brawlers here. Up of the, the logs and Skull pushing in onto their location here. They're very split up, Skull. They aren't going in as a full squad. So they have a little bit less firepower under their belt. Could be a little bit difficult to try and get it done. Wow, Solar actually taking the Harry Potter tower from Maximus Alpha as Kratugia tries to push back to cover here. Try to get some kills, get King, a res, but Mordor and a waste want to try and stop this. The spray down comes down from Kratugia and a headshot into a waste going to be good. Mortal gets the jumping spray onto Kratugia and will be able to get the revive you'd think onto a waste in the Harry Potter Tower. Two downs by the tower. I think one was further up the hill. We'll see if they're able to get it done. But Pixel Spades now starting to try and move on forwards. But Pain Esports, they're taking the hurt over onto Learn From Pass as well. The backup is going to go in from Seoul as this rotation from the west starts to come on through. Pixel Spades zooming up the hill trying to get to the logs. Log yard for themselves. It's going to be very difficult as they crash on in there. About four teams already pushed up and they've gone straight into Hydra here. Going to be spraying down, confirming kills onto HB and RNG Gaming, I believe. This is a really hectic fifth zone. There's 15 teams still standing and you can see how spread out everyone is. How Sharko to, to find another knock. Evil Big Fella's firing back onto Orb this time from down the hill. Now the Brawler's under fire as well. Pixel. Spades will go out, and so will the Brawlers. 14th and 15th position for them, and I think the Brawlers are now out of top place, but Orb trying to keep this alive against Evil Big Fellas. The spray down's onto Neo. That's a burning vehicle. Neo, you need to get away from it. I'm pretty sure it hasn't been blown up yet. Oh, no, it has. I'm, I'm silly. It's very much blown up. <laughs> okay. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Hydra, decent sh decent position at the moment on the western side of the circle. Evil Big Fella's vying for it, but this northern flank is so messy. Yes. Nobody really with a safe spot at this stage. 
about eight teams all crowded into that northern side of the circle. And Skull losing their split here. They had a 3-1 a split. And unfortunately for Ashish, it is going to be Godel to clean that one up. Look at Team India, though, snaking up behind Skull. They've heard that orb going off, and it doesn't look like Skull are aware whatsoever of Trance's flank onto them. Could be detrimental if India wanted to snake all the way up and try and steal that orb from Jonathan, as well as take that position on the eastern flank. Alright, so Aladdin trying to keep them in the running. So they spray through the smoke onto Payne here. If they can take out Payne, then all they have to deal with is learn from passing the Harry Potter Tower. I mean, a hard task, it's not easy. Looks like the spray downs have come through onto Skull as well, but where from? North? Potentially, that's where they're currently smoking towards. This is the time for Team India to strike if they wanted to, and looks like Trance is going to go for it. He's pushing up. Is he going to get the spot? Jonathan, though, it's at the back. Drops the smoke down, and he's going to change his angle, but Payne Esports trying to fight out with ISO as well, making this push. ISO obviously very split up. They need to try and find something in it, and they are going to be able to make this cross so far. Soul now under fire from Hydra, trying to find anything. Those vehicles under threat as well. Godkill has been knocked already, but Joker, one of the most dynamic players, is showing just why he is one of the best. And he is going to go in. Goes down, though, unfortunately before he can do too much more mortal able to win it out and you can see Ronak on the flank soul giving them the fight they asked for really nice position here from Ronak to flank on in will it be successful what? enough is the question teams going out quickly and it is going to be soul losing members across the board evil huh. losing members to viper going out so that is going to be hydra learn from class all taking out soul here swag <laughs> alpha swag what? I mean, the Mega's just hiding here. Uncle for his innate in, but I, mean, I don't think it's going to connect because it's going to hit the Darcy instead of blowing up on Maximus Alpha. 